Imagine a place where danger lurks at every corner, where the very ground you stand on or the air you breathe can be deadly. From natural disasters to wild, untamed territories, the United States is home to some of the most perilous places on Earth. Today, we take you on a journey through the 15 most dangerous places in the USA. Let's get started. Our first stop is a place that seems deceptively peaceful, Mount Rainier, Washington. At more than 14,000 feet, this majestic mountain dominates the skyline of the Pacific Northwest, but beneath its serene exterior lies a ticking time bomb. Mount Rainier is an active stratovolcano, and scientists believe it could erupt at any time. When it does, it's not just the lava you have to worry about. This mountain is also covered in glaciers, and an eruption could cause massive lahars, deadly mud flows that could wipe out entire towns in minutes. In fact, past eruptions have left their mark on the landscape, showing just how devastating Rainier can be. If you're thinking of hiking here, you'd better be prepared. This is one of the most dangerous mountains in the United States, and it's not just because of the potential eruption. The unpredictable weather and treacherous terrain have claimed many lives. Next, we journey to a place where the heat alone can kill you, Death Valley, California. This infamous desert holds the record for the highest temperature ever recorded on Earth, a blistering 134 degrees Fahrenheit. But it's not just the heat that makes this place dangerous. Death Valley is a desolate, unforgiving landscape where water is scarce and the rugged terrain can quickly disorient you. The dry, cracked earth may look lifeless, but this desert is teeming with hazards. Venomous snakes and dangerous wildlife are just a few of the threats you might encounter. Yet, despite the risks, thousands of people visit Death Valley every year, drawn by its eerie beauty. But beware many have underestimated this place and paid the ultimate price. Heading east, we find ourselves in the wild heart of Yellowstone National Park, Wyoming. While Yellowstone is famous for its stunning geysers and vibrant hot springs, it's also home to one of the world's largest supervolcanoes. This massive caldera last erupted 640,000 years ago, and if it were to erupt again, the consequences would be catastrophic. The entire continent could be blanketed in ash, and the climate could be altered for years. But that's not the only danger here. The park is also home to unpredictable geothermal features, boiling hot springs and geysers that can erupt without warning. And let's not forget the wildlife. Bison, bears, and wolves roam these lands, and they can be as dangerous as the landscape itself. Yellowstone is a natural wonder, but it's also a place where nature's raw power is on full display. Next up is a place where the winds can strip flesh from bone, Mount Washington, New Hampshire. This peak may not be the tallest in the USA, standing just over 6,000 feet, but it's notorious for having some of the worst weather in the world. In 1934, a wind speed of 231 miles per hour was recorded here, a record that stood for decades. The extreme winds, freezing temperatures, and sudden blizzards make this mountain a formidable foe for hikers and climbers. Many have lost their lives attempting to conquer Mount Washington, falling victim to hypothermia or being blown off course by the relentless gales. This is a mountain where even the most experienced mountaineers can find themselves in mortal danger. We now move to the southern swamps of Atchafalaya Basin, Louisiana. This vast wetland is the largest swamp in the United States, and it's home to an array of dangerous creatures. Alligators, venomous snakes, and wild boars roam these murky waters, but they aren't the only threats. The swamp's dense vegetation and labyrinth of waterways can easily disorient even the most seasoned explorer. If you're unlucky enough to get lost here, you could find yourself trapped in a living nightmare. And then there's the unpredictable weather. Torrential rains can cause the water levels to rise rapidly, flooding the area and making escape nearly impossible. The Atchafalaya Basin is a place where nature reigns supreme, and humans are just visitors in a world that can quickly turn deadly. In the heart of Alaska lies a place so remote and treacherous that it's earned a reputation as one of the most dangerous wildernesses in North America, Denali National Park, Alaska. Denali, also known as Mount McKinley, is the highest peak in North America, towering at about 20,000 feet. Climbing this mountain is no small feat. The weather is brutally cold, the terrain is unforgiving, and the altitude can wreak havoc on even the fittest climbers. But it's not just the mountain that's dangerous. 
The surrounding wilderness is home to grizzly bears, wolves, and other predators, and the extreme cold can lead to frostbite or worse. Denali is a place of raw, untamed beauty, but it's also a place where the unprepared can quickly find themselves in serious trouble. Heading south, we find ourselves in New Orleans, Louisiana, a city with a long history of hurricanes and flooding. But it's not just the natural disasters that make this city dangerous. New Orleans is also home to one of the most haunted and mysterious places in the country, the French Quarter. This historic district is famous for its vibrant nightlife and stunning architecture, but it's also known for its dark past. From voodoo curses to restless spirits, the French Quarter is steeped in supernatural lore. And if that's not enough to send shivers down your spine, the area is also prone to violent crime, making it a place where danger can strike from both the living and the dead. We now travel to the rugged cliffs and wild forests of Big Sur, California. This stunning stretch of coastline is famous for its breathtaking views and winding roads, but it's also one of the most dangerous driving routes in the country. The Pacific Coast Highway, which runs through Big Sur, is a narrow, twisting road that hugs the edge of steep cliffs. One wrong move and you could find yourself plunging into the ocean far below. Landslides are also common here, blocking roads and trapping travelers. And then there's the wildfire risk. California's dry conditions mean that a single spark can turn this paradise into a hellscape in a matter of hours. Big Sur is a place of unparalleled beauty, but it's also a place where nature's fury is always just around the corner. Our next stop is a place where the air itself can be deadly, Centralia, Pennsylvania. This small town was once a bustling coal mining community, but today it's a ghost town, abandoned because of a fire that's been burning beneath the ground for over 50 years. The fire started in a coal mine in 1962 and has been smoldering ever since, sending toxic gases and smoke billowing into the air. The ground is unstable, with sinkholes and cracks appearing without warning, making it incredibly dangerous to walk around. Centralia is a chilling reminder of how man's actions can unleash a disaster that lasts for generations. Next, we arrive at Lake Michigan, a place where the water hides many dangers. The Great Lakes are known for their unpredictable weather, but Lake Michigan is particularly treacherous. Strong currents, sudden storms, and freezing temperatures make it one of the most dangerous bodies of water in the USA. The lake has claimed countless lives over the years, earning it the nickname, the Graveyard of the Great Lakes. And it's not just the water that's dangerous. The shoreline is dotted with old shipwrecks and treacherous sand dunes that can swallow up unsuspecting hikers. Lake Michigan is a beautiful but deadly reminder of the power of nature. As we continue our journey, we find ourselves in the unforgiving wilderness of Glacier National Park, Montana. This breathtaking park is known for its stunning mountain landscapes and crystal clear lakes. But don't let the beauty fool you. Glacier is as dangerous as it is mesmerizing. The park is home to some of the most remote and rugged terrain in the United States, where sudden weather changes can turn a peaceful hike into a fight for survival. But the real danger here lies in the wildlife. Glacier is grizzly bear country, and these massive predators roam the forests and valleys in search of food. Encounters with grizzlies are rare, but potentially deadly. And if the bears don't get you, the icy waters and steep cliffs just might. Glacier National Park is a place where nature's raw power is always on display, and only the most prepared and vigilant will make it out unscathed. Next, we head to the vast and remote wilderness of Wrangell St. Elias National Park, Alaska. Covering over 13 million acres, this is the largest national park in the United States, and it's a place where the dangers are as immense as the landscape. Here, towering mountains, massive glaciers, and wild rivers create a terrain that's both awe-inspiring and treacherous. The park is so remote that there are no roads leading into its interior. Most visitors arrive by bush plane, and once you're in, you're on your own. This isolation means that help is far away if things go wrong, and the park's extreme weather, rugged terrain, and abundant wildlife all pose significant threats. From avalanches to bear attacks, Wrangell St. Elias is a place where adventure and danger go hand in hand. Now we move to the fiery depths of Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. 
This park is home to two of the world's most active volcanoes, Kailauia and Mauna Loa. These giants have been erupting for centuries, constantly reshaping the landscape with rivers of molten lava. But it's not just the lava flows that make this place dangerous. The volcanic gases released during eruptions are toxic, and the ground itself can suddenly give way as new cracks and fissures open up. The park's stunning lava fields and craters are a testament to the raw power of the Earth. But they're also a reminder that this is a land in constant flux. Visitors must be vigilant as the landscape can change in an instant, turning a serene hike into a desperate race for survival. We now find ourselves in the heart of the Mojave Desert at Joshua Tree National Park, California. This stark and beautiful landscape is known for its twisted Joshua trees and massive rock formations, but it's also a place where the desert's harsh conditions can quickly turn deadly. Temperatures in Joshua Tree can soar above 100 degrees Fahrenheit during the day and plummet below freezing at night, creating a harsh environment where dehydration and heat stroke are constant threats. The park's vast barren expanses can disorient even experienced hikers, and many have gotten lost in its maze of rocks and canyons. With little shade and even less water, Joshua Tree is a place where the desert's beauty hides its deadly nature. Finally, we arrive at the wild, untamed shores of Cape Hatteras, North Carolina. This stretch of coastline is part of the Outer Banks, a chain of barrier islands known for their treacherous waters and unpredictable weather. Cape Hatteras is often called the Graveyard of the Atlantic because of the hundreds of shipwrecks that lie off its coast. The powerful currents and frequent storms make these waters some of the most dangerous in the world. But it's not just the ocean that poses a threat. Hurricanes regularly batter the islands, bringing devastating winds and flooding. The shifting sands and eroding shorelines add another layer of danger, as entire sections of the coast can disappear overnight. Cape Hatteras is a place where the forces of nature are constantly at work, and where danger is never far from the surface. And there you have it. Thank you so much for joining us on this perilous journey. For more videos like this one and U.S. destination ideas, remember to subscribe to our channel. Stay vigilant out there, and see you in the next adventure.